Well, from Third Mutual today, we have James Tung, and James is here to talk about several issues. I know uh, landscape, of course, is uh, one of your biggest concerns, and the yes. budget, looking at the uh, budget for 2019 is right in the middle of, of it right now for landscape and really everything, but I know landscape is uh, the committee that you're on. Right. Uh, well, the Certain Mutual Board felt that, uh, well, starting with our president, Bruce Marie, that uh, we need to start looking not only just uh, each year, every year, but we need to look uh, long term. Mm -hmm. So that's what, uh, that uh, this year, we have uh, several long-term strategic meetings. Uh, this, of course, concerning the landscape, uh, maintenance constructions, uh, co communications, uh, several different committees, so, so that we can set up a little bit longer ago. Right. Now, as far as the landscape is concerned, we have cases that, uh, you know, some, part, some of the slopes, for example, uh, a couple of years ago, they planted, replanted, mm -hmm. but now part of the slope already become barren. So, you know, we were wondering what happened here. So we got to, uh, then we'll realize, oh, in the past, the landscape, we do have a slope of maintenance. Right. But talking to our staff, Maintenance only means they, if they see a barren, they just replant and maybe changing the water a little bit. So if the plant uh, does not fit the, or soil does not fit the plant, mm -hmm. so the plant dies. Right. So that's why one of the term or the high priority we called now in the next year, we call the slope of renovation. That implies that uh, uh, when, when we see uh, barren sl slopes or we want to improve the slopes, we have to look everything. Right. Look at the soils. We, need, we may need to recondition the soil and the amount of watering, sprinkler, co all combinations to then we'll look into the, the what is appropriate to plants to plant. Mm -hmm. That's right. what we call the slope of renovation. So as I mentioned, uh, after a strategic meeting, uh, fire uh, prevention, of course, is a very important on top priority. So fire prevention, slope renovation, and <clears throat> excuse me, then we, <clears throat> we actually we call landscape renovation, which implies that we want to do better because uh, basically California is a, is a desert mm -hmm. weather. And uh, now with uh, so much plan, you know, turf, uh, grass. Uh, uh, as our gov governor indicated that we is going to be California is going to be in the drought right. for the years to come. So we have to modify our concept. Uh, we we now we call the water saving landscape, and that's what we're going to continue doing. You know, every discussion will look and compare. And show the rest and the, the pictures. Mm -hmm. uh, what is the water saving landscape? How does that uh, look to you? We want all the residents accept those new concepts. Right. You know, we yeah. have to reduce uh, the amount of uh, uh, grass, turf, to save water. So yeah, those exactly. are the things that are it's a, on top of our mind. Yeah, that's that's what we call the, you know uh, uh, long term strategic. Strategic, strategy. Yeah, yeah that'll. Um, yeah. That's yeah. something that really yeah. everyone has to do. But I know the slopes have always been a big concern. Yeah, it's hard to maintain uh, proper landscape on any slope anywhere. Yeah. So, so yeah. next year's budget, we sit. We already talk about it. We yeah. set aside the fund for those uh, few, you know, uh, particular purposes. So we have the money. Uh, yeah. To do it. Yes. All right, moving on to um, uh, bluebird boxes. Yeah, which is um, another, <laughs> you know, the, the kind of a, GR, uh, yeah. a discussion in the community for the, the last. The GRF few and the United, everybody's talking because the people. Uh, I think there is a gentleman, uh, uh, Mr. Hanson. He yes. he he's the one started. He says, "Oh, you know, 
well, people, some of the people feel maybe the total num number of bluebirds is in a declining mm -hmm. because of uh, inappropriate uh, um, maintenance of those boxes right. or arrangement for the bluebird. But actually, so we take up as an as a issue, so we ask our staff, landscape skeptic, to mm -hmm. investigate a little bit, and our board director, Jews, also talking to people, talk to the, to the, to the Rose uh, right. resident uh, uh, owns the boxes, mm -hmm. and uh, uh, after discussing, and they they all feel no, we we are uh, we are taking good care of it, so we don't need anybody else coming to interfere with our work. Right. So so we had to made a decision. We're not going to do anything, but uh, but a certain mutual is going to form a task force. Okay. And heading up by. You know, one of our director, Jew Zalen, that uh, combined with several residents, and then so they're going to mon continue to monitor the bluebird, bluebird boxes okay. situation. Okay. Yep. All right. Very good. Now, uh, mm -hmm. your last topic you want to talk about yeah. is uh, you know there's been problems with uh, homeless uh, right along the Ridge Route area yeah. near Carlotta. Well, we we look at it, you know, both maintenance and the landscape. We look at it. And uh, the reason why uh, homeless people tend to hide their, we, you know, we went there, look mm -hmm. at there's, there's uh, you know, like a McDonald's boxes. Uh, yeah. There's uh, tracks for people sleeping there. It's many because of those uh, uh, heavily wooded area. Nobody, right. nobody can see them. Mm -hmm. so, so we have uh, decided, you know, both the, the third mutual, first thing we have to do is, uh, Clean up those uh, heavy woods, right? So that uh, so that they cannot hide. That will should not only make the area looking cleaner, mm -hmm. but if they cannot hide, the tendency they will slip there will be less. Right now, for the safety of our community, because a part of that fence is too low, so uh, maintenance construction already already made a proposed project. We're going to build up some uh, some fence, right? Metal yes. fence on top of those. And that's something you're still looking into as far as the type of. Uh, no, no, we already look at it. Called we call the, the shepherd's crook. Okay. Yeah, it's just a matter of okay. final design and quote and get going. Okay. Of course, that will be after we clean clean up those just so okay. heavy wood. So that will be done in a couple months. Yeah. Okay. I mean. As far as cleaning is concerned, okay. so we are both already signed, gave them, you know, approved the contract. Yeah. All right. Very so, good. Anything yeah. else you'd like to add for today? Oh, uh, I believe that's uh, that's uh, that's enough. Of course, as a part of the water conservation, please, we a certain mutual each year, we spend more than a million dollars on the water. Right. So please, the resident, conserve your usage of water. All right, very good. <laughs> nice to see you, sir. Same and, too. Uh, you know, uh, we'll be uh, mentioning all these budget meetings that are going on as they come up. So you are invited to most of them. There's sometimes a few closed door ones, but for the most part, they are open and we we'll let you know about those. Good to okay. see you. Thank, Thank you. you. We'll good right to back. be here. Thank you.